Yes, the women's F34 shot put competition. It was the very first event to start, actually, at the beginning of day one. This for athletes with cerebral palsy. F34, it means that's the most able... Uh, sorry, I beg your pardon. That's the least able of the cerebral palsy categories, which means some athletes are comfortable coming up in their wheelchairs and one or two are on foot. The Russian there assisted by the sticks. So, what a great day it's turning out to be for the Polish athletes. We've just seen a magnificent victory on the track in the men's 1500 meters. And another gold medal here at the start of the day in the field events. Crowds beginning to swell here. We've got some absolutely brilliant track action for you and field event finals. So the bronze medalist from Germany. Good performance this. Francis Herman, she got a bronze in the javelin in Doha last year. A bronze medalist in 2014 as well. Doing so once again here. So, silver medal, the 21-year-old Russian, Elena Orlova. She saved her very best effort for the sixth round, and that was good enough for European Championship silver. Magnificent medals, and we'll see a few of those awarded over the next five and a half days. You do have a lot of ceremonies in IPC athletics as a result of there being so many different categories, all of them deserving their moment in the sunshine. But the winner, and by quite some margin, the class act of the field, Luciana Cornobiez, bronze in Doha in the shot put, a silver two years ago in the European Championships. And she's upgraded to gold here in Grosseto and done so in fine style. 8.33 in the fourth round. And once again, we will hear the Polish national anthem in this stadium that hosted Olympic football way back when in 1960. The Polish woman utterly dominant in the first event of day one. She's the European champion. crowd as Will was saying it's free entry and there are one or two more people making their way in to the stadium confirmation of the gold silver and bronze Poland Russia and Germany and what a brilliant first day this is turning out to be for the Polish athletes